Welcome back to Fallout 1.5 Resurrection. Let's spend our skill points from the level up that we just got, and then we're gonna break into the sheriff's place and steal some nuggets. All right, let's put a couple points in the small guns. And then let's put a bit in the speech. A bit into science. And then a bit into lockpicking. Yeah, that looks good to me. Okay, and actually... Mm, no, never mind. I was going to go maybe buy that rifle before going to the sheriff's place, but... Let's actually do the sheriff's thing first. I don't know, maybe I'll get some money out of it or something. So this is probably the fastest... Oh, wait, actually, before I do that, I need to make sure it's the right time. So it's between... I think it was like 10 at night and 4 in the morning. Nope. Let's wiggle around a bit. Oh, just passed it. Can I, like, choose how long to wait? Can I Z on the... No, I can't. I can't sleep on the overworld map. Come on. Little bit. Oh, perfect. Uh, what was it? Main Street? No. This is where the guns are. It was, um, downtown. Okay. So there should be a rope waiting for me on the south side. Oh, this is going to be so cool. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I should probably max the brightness, huh? There it is. Okay. I am going to have to reload my game about two bajillion times, I'm pretty sure. I definitely want to leave my people behind. Sorry, Carrie. Sorry, Woofer. Okay. Well, I should probably save here, huh? Yeah, so I guess I should use my sneak skill, which is complete garbage. It's 19%, but hey, it's better than nothing, huh? So, safe. I need to get into the main building, probably. I don't think I can go that way. That person just seems stuck there. These guards move, so I could avoid them. Um, well, I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's in here. Let's try here first. You know, I probably shouldn't be running if I want to sneak, huh? Oh well. Oh fuck, what the- <laughs> There's a cop right there! They didn't notice me? Hi. Who are you? Hmm. This might work out really well. My speech skill's decent. I'm, uh, the new girl. I'm new here. Nonsense. Maro's not hiring anyone right now. You're not supposed to be here. Oh, fuck. Sounds like they just shot me with a BB gun. I swear... Are these even speech checks? Like, really? My speech skill is not bad. Not bad at all. It's 78. Wait, no, that was science. It's... what is it? 84. Try the other option? I mean, I don't even have to talk to them. <laughs> Well, I'm not supposed to steal anything other than the nuggets, so won't bother with that. Um, 
If I wasn't supposed to be here, I wouldn't have gotten here. I have a private meeting with the sheriff and it's none of your business. Make yourself useful and leave me alone. I apologize. Okay. Hmm. All right. That worked. I don't know if that really solved anything, though. I might have talked that person into believing that I'm supposed to be here, but what about everybody else? Like, let me test it. Are they going to try to kill me if they see me? Oh, no, they're cool with it. Okay. All right, then. Can I perhaps rappel down this well? Damn it. Oh, it's a bathroom. There's probably a little point in looking at these side buildings, but I'm a little bit curious. I don't know, maybe I'll find something interesting like this. What the heck is this? This video display unit has a variety of computer monitors and other screens. It looks very, very busy. Can I... Can I science that? Nope. Power generator. Can I science that? Can I knock out the lights or something? I don't know. Is there a back door? Doesn't seem like it. So I've just got to go in through the front door, I guess? It looks like I have the same conversation with every guard. Through the front door we go, then. Maybe the cook can help me out or something. Hmm. Uh, yeah, take it easy, I have a deal for you. I'll give you 50 caps if you distract your boss for a while. What? Okay, but how? I barely get to see him normally. Uh, don't worry, I'll think of something. While she counts the caps, you take advantage of her distraction and throw a couple of pots and some plates down from the table. The impact creates enough noise to be heard through the whole house. <laughs> okay, that's my plan, apparently. Go earn those caps. I hope they don't kill her. Apparently that's going to distract the boss. Okay, that's got to be the boss coming out. Alright, just going to sneak in. By that I mean literally sprint into your place. Um... Random turning of the dial yielded no results. They did give me the combination, right? 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 You gotta be kidding me if they didn't. I thought, like, it just... What? Fuck. This isn't good. I thought it... I thought the guard just, like, gave me the combination, basically, and that it would just work. Um, pretty sure my lockpick skill is nowhere near good enough, but let's try the tools. Come on. I don't think this is gonna work, fuck me. Don't suppose there's a combination somewhere around here, a piece of paper with a thingy or something? Ooh, it's got handbook. Alright. Wait, am I supposed to see only- oh, fuck. Alright, this is gonna work. This isn't gonna work anyway. Um. Let's just go back here, I'm just gonna go out and... 
I don't know. I don't have to pay the guy 2,000, do I? I thought it was either pay him 2,000 and he does it for me, or I do it myself and that's it. What is going on? I guess I'm supposed to just be... I guess I'm just supposed to be good at picking the lock. Fuck me. So if you're not good at lock picking, you're out 2,000? Shit. If I have to actually pay 2,000 and I don't make any of my money back, then I'm not going to be able to afford the rifle that I want. I don't think I can do anything about it. Alright, let me see if there's something super clever to do. Just, maybe there is something around here. The, ooh, the desk is locked. Okay. Well, I've got a better chance of lockpicking that. <sighs> God, my lockpicking skill is garbage. I really don't know if this will succeed if I keep trying it. I thought it was a random percent chance, but I'm starting to think it isn't. One more time. Alright, that's not gonna work. What about the survival book? I don't think that's lockpicking, but um... I think it's outdoor skill, but let me try it anyway. Yeah, wilderness survival. Fuck. Alright, let's talk to some other people in here. Yeah, so the boss is already going back, so I've lost that chance. But I'm gonna talk to everyone else and see... What's going on? Leave you alone, alright. Sorry, sorry. I don't think the combination would be in one of these bookshelves. I really don't want to pay that 2000 Is this the wife? Hmm. Is this safe? Also, that bed looks disgustingly dirty. Jesus Christ. What are you doing here, and who are you, anyway? Uh, I'm new. I'm the new girl. I don't think so. I'd say you're just a filthy thief. Haha, <laughs> goodbye. Fuck. <laughs> right. 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 Well, this is a problem. Hmm. It seems like I really do have to pony up 2,000 if you suck at, um, lockpicking. Alright, let me just try something real quick. I'm gonna see if it is actually possible to lockpick and it's just a really low percent chance, so I'm gonna cut here and I'll be right back. Damn. Alright, well, I tried a bunch of things. I tried lockpicking just the desk like 20 times. Um, I tried pickpocketing the main boss just to see if he had maybe the desk key on him or something. He didn't. Yeah, there's just nothing I can do. If your lockpick isn't good enough, you're screwed. Got to pony up 2,000, I guess. As much as it pains me, I'm going to do it. Goodbye, rifle. Alright. Uh... Here, take them. They're bloody valuable. I'm tempted to, tempted to keep them myself and to hell with you. But don't worry. We'll search all of us as soon as the sheriff finds out. I'll have to do with the cops. Have to do with the I Have to deal with the cops? I'll have to, Oh, I'll have to do with the caps. Sorry. A and O looks exactly the same. Alright, see ya. 
five pounds of gold. Six times five pounds of gold. Jesus Christ. That's a lot of gold. I don't entirely remember where the ghouls were. I remember the building, I just don't remember what part of town it's in. Oh, it's, yeah, right here. Oh, what's happening? Uh-oh. You've been trying senior's patience for too long. He offered you a chance to leave and you rudely refused it. Therefore, something, something. It's impossible to leave town in the day just like that. Rodriguez must give us more time. Senor no longer cares for your excuses. He wants to finish you once and for all. You will hide nowhere, run nowhere, without his people finding you. You will bitterly regret that you hadn't died on your own long before. Senor Rodriguez will take care of that. Well, it looks like my job might not be quite done. Mimi's wearing a nervous expression on her face. So? Did you manage to get into the sheriff's safe? Were there any nuggets in it? Please, I can't wait to hear about it. Yeah, here you go. You really did it. The sheriff must be going through the roof right now. He'll raise hell with all the men he's got, but he won't even think about looking for them in Falcon's flight. Those gold nuggets will be safe... Uh, safe in here. Please, take this modest sum from me. These are the last caps we've got, but we won't need them now that we have the nuggets. It's the best I can give them. Uh, it's best I give them to you as a reward. Okay, so I got some of the money back, but definitely not all of it. Thanks, Mimi. But you can tell me now, who's the man that threatened you? Mimi suddenly becomes very sad. That was a messenger from Juan Rodriguez, the mobster from Last Town. I guess I should have told you right from the start. He's the main reason we want to leave, said it. He's been turning the whole town against us, and recently, well, we received an ultimatum. Either we leave, or he'll have us murdered. And the time's up now. I don't know what to do. We can't hide from his men. Not here, not anywhere. Rodriguez won't rest until we're dead. Alright. I'll deal with him. Don't underestimate Rodriguez. He's getting plenty of caps from his casino. Caps he can use to hire the best bodyguards with. Nobody can get to him. And even if you managed to kill Rodriguez, there'd still be Sanchez, his right hand. He'd run the mobster family with the same cruelty and he'd be looking for a revenge for the murder of his boss. You'd find yourself in big danger. You don't have to worry about me. I'll kill Rodriguez and that lackey of his, Sanchez, as well. You'll see. I really wish I had that rifle now. Christ. I wonder how much time I have. Hopefully as long as I want. Like, I just want to do other quests so I can afford the freaking rifle before I do that. And ammo. We don't even have ammo for my Desert Eagle. I'm sure I could afford it though, but, uh, hmm. Hmm. Alright, well, here's what I'm going to do for now. I'm gonna get the hell out of town and move around until it's daytime so I can actually see. And then I'm gonna go buy some ammo for my Desert Eagle, and then I'm gonna do the Frederick Stream quest. There we go. 11 a.m. Guns were... Main Street? Oh, let me turn the brightness back to... Human levels. Guns, guns, guns! Alright, what ammo does this take? 44. Well, they're probably going to be armored, the people... Yeah, I'm pretty sure the people that tried to kill me 
But the Frederick Stream quest were armored, so let's go for. Oh my god, this game is literally unplayable. Look at this. With one ammo, Magnum is capitalized, the M, and the other, it's not. Ugh. I hate it. I don't remember which one's which. Crap. Full metal jacket? Which one pierces armor? I guess it's whichever one's more expensive. 127. Double the same price! Fuck me. Damage mod to... Which one? Jacketed hollow point hollow okay, hollow point's not what we want. No no no. Full metal jacket, yeah. Okay. Forty of that and twenty of that. Yeah, that's good. Let's sell some of this weird stuff. That's taking up my inventory. Meat jerky, I don't think I need that much meat jerky. Don't need the knife. Don't need booze. Um, yeah, you can have both grenades, it's fine. I don't think I need them. Iguanas. That's good. You owe me... I don't know. Shit, too much. Very close. Three more. Load this with a full metal jacket. That is the right one, right? Right? Yeah, hollow point is definitely not the kind that pierces armor. I don't really understand what the DR mod is. Also, I don't understand why the armor class is the same for both. That is what AC is, right? The damage mod is different though. 2111. One, one. I don't know what the hell that stuff means, but let's just load this in. Alright, to Frederick Stream. Freddy? Oh. Hey! My money is... Leet. Nice. Uh, so I have to do this quest. Hopefully this doesn't override the other quest to help Frederick stream out. Um, I have a message to you from Kevin. Said at Caravan would like to discuss some unfinished things from the last council meeting. The meeting should take place this evening in the official room. Set a caravan? That doesn't sound right. I don't have a particularly good relationship. Um, oh, it looks like good. This isn't ruining it. So will you go there in my stead? I can still talk to Kevin again or just I'll go there. Eh, I'll just go there. Alright, let's hope I don't die this time. So, same as before, ba ba ba. Cutscene, and then. I think three people try to kill me. And unfortunately, they get the first shot. Okay. Ooh. Knocked him to the ground. Nice. Well, my. Accuracy is shit because it's nighttime, so what the hell, let's get up, up in their faces. Yeah, stab him. Thirty hit points, nice.
Oof. Oof. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. That's good. Okay, I definitely need to heal. Goodbye, all my stim packs. Wait, does that guy got a knife? That guy's got a knife. Screw him. Yeah, I got him. Oh, no, they're just unconscious. Yeah, good enough. Carrie, no offense, but I wish you used weapons. I mean, guns. Hey, Carrie Gillum. Good job. I love Carrie and Woofer, but I gotta be honest, they're really not very helpful in combat. 57% chance to hit, that's it? Let's get a little bit closer. Alright, that's better. Ooh. Ah, oh, fuck. Damn. That's my latest one, isn't it? Should have saved. Alright, it's only like 15 seconds away. I mean, I could try to talk it out with Kevin. I am better with speech than with guns, I suppose. Nah, that hasn't worked out so well, so far. Okay. So for better luck this time. Hit him in the eyes. Good. Good! Shooting someone else! That's actually good. And they're running away, I think? Good, good, good. Woof, woof! Get him, woofer. Woof him to death. No, don't you- Oh, god, that was a crit. Okay, good, they didn't shoot me. Good, good, good. I need to heal. Mm. I'll take another one. Just fucking die. Dear God, die! Mm. She slumps to the... Oh, she's not dead. Good. Did I say- Oh fuck, I just accidentally skipped my turn. No, Carrie's dead. I can't live with that. I wish I had that rifle. I wish I had that rifle. That sounded good. Unconscious. Good start. Yeah, stab him while he's down. Let's get the other one with a gun. Oh, that is not a good chance to hit. 
Well, fine. Okay, you're holding your gun in your right hand. Let's fuck up your right arm. That didn't do much. Yeah, knock him down. Good. Okay, this is looking really good. That's not so good. Let's get real close. Just get the one with the gun to the ground, yes. Shoot someone else, that's good. Sorry, Carrie, but you got more you got more hips than I. Fucking die! I wonder if hollow points are better against heads. I don't know how the game calculates damage. Like, if you hit somebody in the head, does it bypass armor anyway? I don't know. I mean, like, even, like, power armor, though, for example, has a headpiece, so that wouldn't make any sense. Jesus Christ. Come on, we have such an advantage. We can't lose this. <gasps> They're running! Good! No, they got up! Yeah, fuck you. Knocked down again. You know, I really don't want to let this fucker go. But I don't think I can... Yeah, there's no room to actually get through here. I could try moving here. Yeah, I got a shot on him. Sweet. Um, <laughs> shoot him in the leg. Hey, there we go. Fuck you, asshole. Alright, we're good now. They're running away. Good. Almost dead. Nah, shoot him in the groin. Fuck you, asshole. Oh crap, I need to reload. Alright, we did it. Money, money, money. Ooh. Combat knife. I think that's better than what Carrie currently has, isn't it? Uh, let's give it to her. I think it's better. I think she has something other than a combat knife. I'm not entirely sure. Oh no, I guess she already has it. Huh. Oh, I thought she was using like a, I don't know, a crappier knife or something. Alright then, I'll sell this one. Let's go make a daytime once again. Oh, where the hell am I? It's so dark. Where is the end of the world? There it is. So, what was it like? What happened? There was a woman dressed in black, and as soon as I walked in, she set her men on me. 
She certainly wanted to kill you. She was quite disappointed I was there instead of you. I managed to take care of myself, as you can see, but she escaped. I was Nicole, the owner of Sedit Caravan. I was afraid she'd try something like this. There's quite a bit of competition between our companies. So what are you going to do now? I can't do anything. It's just your word against hers. A stranger's word against the word of the owner of a caravan company. On top of that, she's also a member of the town council. We must let it be. Here, take your reward and try to forget this whole terrible affair as soon as you can. If you say so. You know, my company has another problem, an even bigger one. It's the raiders. My caravans have been facing more and more attacks. You've shown you can handle things when in danger, so I was thinking you might want to help me with them. Of course. Fine, but you have to know it's all more complicated than it may seem at first glance. He sighs. The raiders are attacking every important caravan sent out of town. Because they, because they can't watch the whole wasteland, they must have information from someone inside. Someone from my company who knows all about our caravan routes and when the caravans transport really valuable goods. That narrows it down to three people apart from me. Frost, our caravan leader, my deputy Tim, and our assistant Jeremy. Maybe I'm wrong, but I can't take the risk. I want you to take a closer look at those three. Try inviting them for a drink in the pub and when they're in the mood, talk to them. The culprit will perhaps give themselves away on his own. Okay. What's the pay? I don't have much money, but if you succeed, I'll pay you 400 caps. Ah, oh, come on, you'll have to do better. 600. I really can't give you any more than this. Alright, I'm in. Okay. I think that's a pretty good place to end this episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I am going to speak with Frederick's people and see if I can figure out who is the culprit providing inside information to the raiders. <laughs>